Hi, my name is Miguel from avoiderrors.net. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create a virtual hard drive in Windows 7. So let's begin. Right click on Computer. Then click on Manage. In the Computer Management, select Disk Management. And here, click on Action. Then click on Create VHD Virtual Hard Drive. Now select the location. In this case, I'm going to select my desktop to be the location. And I'm going to name my file Virtual Drive. Click on Save. And the size is going to be 10 gigs. I'm going to select the format to be dynamic. Instead of fixed, dynamic it expands. Fixed it does not, depending on the amount of files you put there. And click OK. Now here my virtual drive is in blue here, 10 gigs. Now I need to initialize. So I'm going to right click and then click on initialize disk. Now here I'm going to leave my settings default master boot record selected and then click OK. Perfect. Now I'm going to select the disk then right click and then click on new simple volume to create a volume and then on the wizard just click next. Here I'm going to use the uh, full size but you can always change the size of the uh, virtual disk and then click next now you can assign a different drive letter if you want from the drop down once you have selected the uh, drive letter click on next here you can change the uh, file system allocation unit size and volume label. I'm going to leave everything in default and only change the volume label. Perform a quick format, perfect, and then click next. And then click finish on the wizard. Perfect. My partition is healthy. Now it shows as a hard disk under volume. And if I go to my computer or computer, I'm sorry, it shows as a regular disk. Now I can save files to it if I wanted to and also use it as a mapped network drive in the network. Thank you for watching this video. If you have any questions, please feel free to post them in the comment section below. Thank you.